Hi guys, welcome back to today's video. Today I'm going to be doing my 32 week pregnancy update. I did have my baby shower this week so I'll talk about that um, and anything else that's happening. So, to get started, I did have my baby shower. It was like this magical, beautiful, like really quaint baby shower. I did, I'm going to put this on. I did wear this lepo'o so like I think like on the mainland everyone like calls it like a flower crown but like in Hawaii it's like a traditional um like thing that we wear on our heads so I'm gonna wear this because it is still so pretty and I can be bougie like that because <laughs> I'm pregnant um but yeah my sister and my mom got this beautiful beautiful let me like have you focus on this beautiful lepo and so I did take some maternity pictures like this and I still want to take more. Um, but my baby shower was twinkle twinkle little star themed. So there was a lot of like gold stars and pink stars and just like this whole um, just like spacey thing. But it was like more like on stars rather than like constellations. I did um, have a lot of family there. I had some of my best friends from high school. And that's like really what I wanted. I didn't need it to be huge where I had like all these people and we invited them just to invite them. It was like really like my group of friends, my, you know, my family, Eric's family, you know, my sister had her friend and that was just perfect to me. The food was good. We did a lot of finger foods. We had fruits and like some like Hawaiian food that we got to take home. Okay, so right now the weather is pretty good not pretty good the weather is really quiet but it is hurricane day like we are in the middle of a hurricane so if the weather like if it just starts to get really loud i might have to stop filming if not i'll try to talk through it and hopefully that's um it'll be okay but my baby shower it was like in a cute little cafe it was closed for the day uh, my brother shot pictures and you know he did the photography for it so the like they're amazing in my last video i did my baby shower haul i did put some pictures but i will probably put some in this video as well eric was there we had the guys kind of set up so my brother my dad i think yeah just my brother my, my two brothers my dad and my and eric so they were all there in the beginning and then like the two boys left and then eric and my brother stayed and so it was really nice because eric got to meet my my family that flew in and we just got to kind of like enjoy the day even though I'm sure he didn't really want to spend his day off at a baby shower. We played a lot of really fun games. My favorite, like I love baby shower games. Um, my friends like had never really been to one but I was really excited for that. We did the, the diaper where you open it up and you have to guess the chocolate bar so it looks like the poop in it. Love that game. I won most of my games, but I felt kind of bad, so I was just like, you know, like, I don't need any of the prizes, but I am really competitive and I love baby shower games. Okay, so that's kind of it for my baby shower. As far as things that are happening this week, I am, like, a little bit more sensitive, like, down there, I've noticed. I did start drinking a raspberry leaf tea because apparently it's supposed to, like, help with your labor. It's supposed to help with um, recovery soften your uterus to prepare you for labor and I'm just kind of like in that place where I'm just starting to do um, as much prep work as I can of course I've been doing my lotions and my oils but like you know drinking teas and stuff like that like that's this is the time where I start doing all of that so after my baby shower we now have access to like the 15% off registry coupons to Amazon and to Target so this upcoming week, if we're just gonna start trying to like just get the rest of everything. I pretty much have everything except for a changing pad and the bathtub, but I did really want to um, pick up a lot of self-care. So a lot of my breastfeeding things, my pump should be coming in soon. I got one of the free like pumps with my insurance through Target and I need like you know my pads the creams i have a, i think someone ordered one on my registry and it should be shipping soon 
um, but I wanted to get the Medela Hydro Gel Pads or something like that. Apparently they're supposed to be amazing. I watched Ellie Meekum's like recovery video and that was something that she suggested. So you know what? If it worked for her, then it'll work for me. My stand books. If you know who he is, you are amazing and you're my kind of person. Um, what else is there? So yeah, so that's like kind of like been a big thing with us. Um, I did miss my appointment today because of the hurricane. So I do have it next week during my 33. So I am now like doing it every other. So when I go in next week, because I missed this week, it'll be the week after. And then I think from then I just start going every month or every week, which is really exciting and kind of like... Like I'm so close and so I'm nervous, but I'm not nervous. I think it's just wanting to be done with the nursery because we haven't even started it. We put together the dresser and that's it. The room is still trying to be cleared. I'm sorry, I'm a hand talker, so this is like my thing. But um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, we just wanna I just wanna get everything done and you know be able to feel like if she came now that she'll have a place to sleep, you know, she'll have everything ready. Um, I have noticed that my hip is starting to get a little sore and I think that does have to do with a lot of me crossing my legs, which I know you're not supposed to do. My back is starting to get a little bit sore and her movements are starting to become painful. And not like excruciating, but they're definitely uncomfortable. And so I think I'm starting to enter like the uncomfortable stage of this pregnancy. Sleep is still really good, except sometimes I'll wake up and she'll just be moving around so much that it'll wake me up. And I mean, that's completely fine. I've been able to work. I am thinking about leaving two weeks early just so that I can have everything done. And I don't know, I think I just, I'm really stressed out about not having it ready that I just want to take some time off, enjoy the rest of it, spend time with Eric and be able to enjoy the last couple of weeks or you know however long it is of it just being the two of us so I'm looking forward to that which means I have about a month left of work which I can't believe um, I can't believe that I think I'm still at 123 pounds so I've gained 18 pounds I think I'll you know pick up the rest of the weight at the ending of this pregnancy but so far I mean the clothes that I'm wearing are still like the same size pre-pregnancy um, of course like my pants don't really fit but like the rest of it is fine um, my shirts are still good I just buy sometimes a little bit longer but since I'm short I don't have to buy too many things some dresses don't fit as well but I've been kind of just enjoying wearing my dresses Sorry, I keep looking. I'm like, I'm tracking the hurricane. It's calm right now, but everywhere else is like completely flooded. I mean, it's flooding over here, but everyone's sending me videos. Let me see if I can pull up. I don't know if you can see that. Oops. It's going to try to focus on my face. It is just flooded everywhere. Eric sent me a video from his house. You may not even be able to see anything. Just tons and tons of rain, but... Oh, the perks of living in paradise, right? Okay, let me show you my belly bump. I think that's all for this update. There's, I don't know, there's it's an easy pregnancy. There's not much happening. Like, even from the beginning, not a lot has changed. I don't know, maybe in the next upcoming weeks things will be happening okay Oops. so you can see the little line okay thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed this video i will see you in my next one bye guys